Uh, we spoke an hour ago on WXSP and WOTV to Holland Mayor El McGeehan. Holland really took a hard hit tonight. We have him on the phone with us again now. Mayor? Yes, we're here. Ha can you describe for me the situation, the latest information you have on um, flooding in your area, power outages, people stranded? I think you just covered the list. We've got all of that. I've spoken uh, to our city manager. We've got all of our Holland Police Department out. They're being assisted by the Holland Fire Department. Again, I want to repeat what we said an hour ago. We want to ask people to stay off the roads. We are barricading many roads around town. Uh, we do have some power line issues. We have some major trees that have come down. And I, I can just tell you that it's going to, now that the rain is slackening, uh, I think the cleanup is going to take uh, the, much of the weekend. We have got hundreds of homes with water in their basements. Mayor, I know that you had asked uh, the viewers and the residents of your area not to call 911 unless it was an absolute emergency. You didn't want them calling to report they had water in their basements and so on. Um, how serious is the situation with 911 and uh, trying to handle these calls? How overloaded are they? I heard uh, that they were about 20 calls backed up for over an hour. And, and the bulk of those calls, look, heartfelt, of course. People were saying that they, they had water in their street, they had water coming in their basement. What do they do? Uh, several of them were from people who were stranded in cars on the street. And, of course, those kinds of issues take precedence. But right now, those calls have begun to subside. Have you heard, Mayor, of any injuries as a result of the flooding? Let me be clear to say that we've been spared uh, any serious injury. There isn't a single report of, of something like that right now. Uh, but there's got a lot of folks who are hurting because of uh, water damage in their homes. Power outage, you're, you're experiencing a great deal of power outages as a result of all those downed trees in your area? I, I don't know if the term great deal is, is appropriate, but we certainly have some of that to contend with. All righty. And the numbers of, of uh, streets, major streets that may be barricaded, shut down right now or impassable, any number for us on that? I, I don't have a number, but let me just tell you, if you don't, I, I'm not even going to say if you don't need to go out, don't go out. Please, just don't go out. And if you are out, stay where you are. All right. Be it's too dangerous to be out there, Susie. Mayor McGeehan, we really appreciate you taking the time to talk to us again uh, on 24-Hour News 8 at 11. I